What's up guys? It's Friday and you know what that means. It's time for another episode of Friday Fossil Mystery. So for this week's episode, we're coming to you straight from the Cooper Center Laboratory. Mostly because this thing is kind of heavy to move. And if this thing looks familiar, it should. This was last week's Friday Fossil Mystery. Now there was quite some debate on exactly what this thing was. Some of you thought it was whale vertebra, but that's wrong. <laughs> this big thing over here is actually a basking shark. One of the telltale signs that it's a basking shark is its gill rakers. These things attach to its gills to help it filter feed as it swam through the ocean. Throughout much of the ancient oceans from the Miocene all the way today, these big basking sharks swam through the coast of California. Being that sharks are mostly made of cartilage, it's rare for any type of fossilization to occur. So this specimen is incredibly rare and valuable. So who correctly guessed what it was? Well that honor belongs to Bobby Bossenecker, a PhD student at the University of Otago in New Zealand. Congratulations dude! So we got one mystery solved, let's go find another. Hi, my name is Myra Sierra and I'm a volunteer here at the Cooper Center and for today's Friday Fossil Mystery we have this. And it's from the early Miocene from the Sespe Vaquero Formation from the Eastern Transportation Corridor. And for a hint, it was once found in America but it's not only found in Africa or Asia. So good luck! Thanks Myra! So again, if you want to send us your answers, we got Facebook and we got Twitter. And really quick, I just want to say thanks to all of you guys for watching Friday Fossil Mystery. Without you guys, there wouldn't be a need to do this. So thanks. We'll see you all next week. Bye. Does anyone want to help me move this? It's kind of heavy. I mean, it's dark and scary in the warehouse. Guys? Guys?